Welcome back to the Isle of Man TT races, fueled by Monster Energy. Time now for our first Super Sport race action of the week. Connor Cummins is with the number one plate on the start line, ready to go. Cameron Donald and Dave Moore are in the commentary box. Could be Dean Harrison's race. Oh, Hickman out from under the trees. Oh, no, that's a cruel blow for Pete Hickman. So here comes Peter Hickman across the line. He wins the Senior TT at 135.4 miles an hour. We've witnessed history. He had a terrible start last time. Look at Locker. He's pushing up for the lead there. Four abreast almost as they go along the flying kilo. Cameron Donald has got it just ahead of him more. Guy Martin looking to sneak ahead, but it's the Australian who's going to lead them down to Leatham's Town for the first time in this restarted race. Thousands of people were sat on that motorbike with Michael, urging him to win. It looks insane, but when you're on the bike, you feel in control. Again, but that was fantastic, and Michael Dunlop means business. The challenge of facing up to danger and overcoming it that attracts them. <laughs> Hatch is the location as three drivers battle it out to be crowned British Touring Car Champion. So let's begin with WRC and Rally Spain. Sebastian Ogier arrives at Rally Spain, trailing championship leader Ot Tanak by 28 points following the previous round at Wales Rally GB. The Grand Prix of Sweden is the setting for the latest round of the World Motocross Championship. Hello and welcome to Hawkstone Park and round six of the Maxis British Motocross Championship. We're at three quarters distance in both of the main championships. Here's the story so far. The MX1 season began with Kevin Strybos winning all three races at Fat Cat. So let's concentrate on MX2 and the man leading the series is Elliot Banks Brown. But Elliot, two fights for you really. One is Mel Pocock and the other one is fitness. Yeah, yeah no, um, I took a crash at Desert Martin in the last race, like two laps ago, and broke my wrist. So. Banks Brown leads. Irwin is second. Where's Pocock? There he is, looks like fifth, he's behind Bradshaw, and what a start for Adam Sterry, bike 811, riding for PAR Honda, he's in third place, didn't even qualify for Super Bowl, but he's running with the big boys out front, not the start Mel Pocock was hoping for, with Banks Brown leading, but it's early days of course. Billy Bolt looking very comfortable in first place, and oh my goodness, he's down, Billy Bolt's in trouble. Now then, he's struggling to get going again. Where's Blazuziak? And here comes Tali Blazuziak onto the top of the bridge. Tali Blazuziak takes over the lead. Billy Bolt has freed himself, but it's too late by the looks of things. Tali Blazuziak now leads when it looked as if Billy Bolt had this race sewn up. My goodness me, no one saw that one, did they? So Blazuziak leads as they start the next lap. 